Good morning, and welcome to the Black Mesa Transit System. This automated train is provided for the company and the audience of Black Mesa residents and visitors to the Black Mesa Research Facility. Time is 3 security facilities. Well, this place is looking pretty familiar. Can you take a guess as to where we are? <laughs> Good day, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, and welcome to Half-Life Blue Shift, one of the many expansion packs for the game Half-Life, which we have just completed not too long ago. And there goes our ride. So, if you remember the guy who was banging on the door at the beginning of the game, Half-Life, that's who we're playing as right now. Our name is Barney Calhoun, and we are a security guard for the Black Mesa Research Facility. And there's Gordon, he's kind of spazzing out in there. Not too sure what's happening. And this is why we're having door issues. Come on. Um, has it ever occurred to you I might have forgotten my pass ID at home? Well, no, that wouldn't really make sense because you kind of need the password ID. That, I'm, I'm, a, I'm an idiot, okay? I'm sorry. Just... Okay, I think I got it. You better have gotten it. Jeez. Sorry about that, Calhoun. We've been having problems all over the facility this morning. 
system crashes, security malfunctions. It's a wonder this whole place hasn't shut down yet. <clears throat> okay then. So, this playthrough is going to be pretty much completely blind. Now, I did play just a little bit of the intro, but aside from that, I really have no idea what's going to happen, and that will make the experience all the more enthralling. So, we as Barney Calhoun, we pretty much have the same abilities as Gordon, except for the flashlight, because I mapped, I mapped the wrong key. Just, just give me a second for this. Um, I have a very specific... Yeah, I I set this to. I'm pretty sure that's self-explanatory. Let me just like set this to B because I rarely swim in this game, as far as I know. Flashlight. There we go. I'll reset that to F. Okay. You. What do you have to say? Gonna let me in? Show past God. Boof. Sorry, Calhoun. I'm on duty. I'm a little busy right now, Calhoun. You are just standing here Calhoun, with your hands you on your you hips, not doing anything at all. Well, at least he was helpful for once. Thank you, Mr. Barney. I mean, um... Thank you, me! <laughs> I don't know what else to call these people. <laughs> can I get a drink or something? Yay, I can, I can still get a drink. They disappear rather abruptly, though. It's kind of, that's kind of depressing. I can't wait to be able to destroy those machines. It's gonna be so much fun. Okay, we got ourselves a little lounge right here. Let's go down and pick up our armor and firearm. Trading saves lives. The future! Success. I show up this morning, Calhoun. Yeah, yeah, I know. Problems with the access system. Hope you're ready for a long shift. Is it just me? Or does everyone on Barney's side of the story sound so depressed this morning? I mean, come on, lighten up. It went... At the beginning of Half-Life, just Half-Life alone. Man, everybody was just, like, having a great time. They were off on their business, they were looking at computers, and... Man, it was just a great day for everyone, albeit a few scientists who were having a couple of personal issues. Such as not having enough toilet paper in I the restroom facility. I can't answer my mail. I haven't even been able to get into my office. I know, sir, I know. We're doing everything we can to get the problem under control. Just give us some time to- Time? I don't have any more time. If I'm not able to get my report to the administrator in the next hour, then my job will be in serious jeopardy. And I'll make sure that mine is not the only one. Shouldn't you be guarding something right now? Um... Couldn't you be guarding some donuts and coffee right about now? No, that that's Otis's job. What do you have Can't in you mind? have your own job to be doing? <sighs> Man, everyone here is a bastard. Shouldn't you be on duty by now? Look <sighs> That guy was just giving you shit talk, and now you're going to give it to me? Dude, that's not fair. <sighs> God, I'm going to hate working here as a security guard. As much as I enjoyed working here as a scientist, being a security guard is just going to be worse. I can tell already. And somebody's already broken into our locker for some reason. Actually, all these lockers are pretty much broken into. Why do they leave them open? Like, what is the point? Oh, that's... I knew that. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I'm smart. I've, I've played this game before, right? Picture! Another picture! Truth about aliens, government and conspiracies. <laughs> Alright, so in case you couldn't tell, we just picked up our armor. Now, the armor, it works a lot differently. Well, I'm not sure. As far as I know, it works differently from the suit energy. Basically, you use helmets and armor, like body armor, chest plates, to restore your armor supply. That's how it works. Out of order. Is this one in order? Yes, but you cannot flush it and... That's kind of disappointing. Can I look in here? Oh my god, what the hell is that? What? What? Can I get in there? What, what is that? That is the scariest... <laughs> that is the scariest thing I have ever seen in this game. What? Can I get a screenshot of that or something? Oh, oh my... Yeah. Look, look at that. Who is that? 
<laughs> oh, Valve. Oh, you. Oh, you. Thanks. But why? I still have to seriously question that. Why is there an image of, like, a guy either missing his eyes, missing his pupils, or he just has really weird looking glasses? Can I please tell me I can get in there? I really want to see what's going on. Is there... Come on, please, just... Can I close the door? Can I jump on the door? Can I... I can't do anything about that. I'm just gonna quick save and forget this ever happened. Uh oh, now what? Looks like some people are having problems with the main access lift in Sector G. Why don't you go over there and see what you can do? Why do I have to do it? What's on this computer screen anyway that's so important to you? You're not even gonna say anything to me now, are you? Ah, I can't really interact with much now, can I? Armory, surveillance. I I don't know if I've gotten my firearm yet. Is this the way to get the firearm? I can't quite remember. Like I didn't play very far into the game. I'm just gonna go back just to be safe. I really won't don't wanna be taking any chances of missing anything, so if we go No way, I don't think I actually did miss anything. No no no, alright, um Calhoun, you know you can't go on duty without your sidearm and uniform. I am wearing my uniform, though. Why can't you just say sidearm? Ugh, lazy development. They don't fix the voice lines. Screw this game. One out of ten. Would not play again. Okay, then. Up the old here we go. There aren't any flashing lights in this one. I'm disappointed. Armory and video surveillance. Let's go to the armory first because they have weapons. There's that scientist again. Authorized personnel only. I'm authorized personnel, aren't I? Oh. I I knew that. <laughs> this is what happens when I sort of partially know what to do in the game already. And man, this was just How's yesterday. It going? Shotguns, can I have one? Here you go, Calhoun. I know you're not on the schedule for a couple more days, but if you want to squeeze in a few shots in the range, there's plenty of room. Okay then. So this is just the shooting range. There really is no purpose for it, it's just a shooting range. But you can get spare ammunition from it. That's kinda cool. So that bar is gonna buy us a beer. This is Otis. You probably saw him earlier. He is a security guard, who is armed with a Desert Eagle. As far as I know, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a Desert Eagle in his holster there. And he loves donuts. Like, man. That must be such a whimsical experience right there, holding that donut. <laughs> uh, I, okay, okay, I'm sorry. Just, yeah. So this is just a shooting range. Practice your aim. Of course, as always, I have auto-aim off. You can make the targets move towards you. So that way you can align yourself if you want. Neat little bonus room. Oh, let's, let's quick save now that we have a weapon. Don't have anything more to say. What does your magazine say? I'm curious. It's a weapons magazine. It's, it's the same pages over and over again. <laughs> That's another point off my final review for the game. <laughs> Man, I wish I could hold this weapon down right now so that way I don't look like I'm going to blow somebody's head clean off. Man, that would be... That wouldn't be really good at all, would it? Let's open the door. The video surveillance room. There's nobody here. Um... Oh yeah, you can look there. There's, there's Dr. Freeman. Gordon! Where are you going? Please don't, please don't leave me alone. Ah. Is there anything else we can look at? Oh, there's, I think that's another one of the characters. That's the one that delivers the sample that Gordon pushes into the feet, the, um, the teleportation beam, whatever it's called. There's the shooting range again. 
I do believe we actually play as that character in one of the expansion packs. I think her name is, um, John Cross. I haven't really read much about the expansion packs, so that way I don't spoil myself anything. Because I want to know as little as possible. One of the things I do know, though... Actually, I don't want to spoil it, because then the surprise would be ruined for you, and you wouldn't be really happy about that, would you? What am I doing? Let's go down the elevator. I can't... I probably can't beat this glass down. Kinda nice if I had a melee weapon right about now. Like, why can't I hit people with this flashlight? That would be the best weapon ever. Just like in two, three. Hey man, I'm trying to duck using the shift key right now. I've been playing Team Fortress 2 lately and I've been trying to get used to that. I have no idea why I want to switch to the C key for this game. <laughs> Somebody's complaining about wearing those ridiculous ties. You have to look dainty, good sir. How's the machine working? Look, I didn't have to slip money in when I ordered my drink. Here. What? Well, well, take your drink? You just wasted a quarter. I hope you realize the importance of money now. Have a good one, Calhoun. Morons. Thank you, Bonnie. I'm going to quick save now. What's down here? Computers! A retinal scanner? No, that's just another computer. Don't you have more important things to be doing than keeping me from my work? I must remember to report that fluctuation. Not really, actually. Because I don't know where I'm going. What the? Oh, hey! Dr. Kleiner, how'd, how'd you get over here? Oh my god! Dr. Kleiner is multiplying like Albert! This should help. Please tell me he gets it fixed. Excuse me, but I'm that doesn't sound right. Can Let I me help you? Okay. I want to get in there. I want to take know something. Doing. Of course. Theoretically. <laughs> you smell something burning. I can't really tell. Right. Let's try this. Well, do you have food? Couldn't you be guarding some donuts and coffee? Right oh my goodness, now? really? <laughs> I'm trying to listen to this conversation. I can barely hear anything because otherwise my voice will be drowned out. This is this isn't pleasant for me. I I can't do anything with this. Scientists they have their own business it seems. You there! If you're waiting for the train to Sector G, then you're probably better off walking it. I overheard someone say that all the trams on this end of the facility are having problems. Problems, you say? Don't worry, I am Mr. Fix-It, and I will fix this problem. Down to maintenance we go. This is gonna be our first job as a security guard is fixing something! No smoking, high voltage. Please tell me, can I, yeah, I can move this, okay, excellent. I don't want to try wasting my bullets to get into that box. Matt, it's dark in here. I don't have, like, a melee weapon or something. Uh, nah, yeah, yeah, stop moving things on your own, Barney. I'll just jump over them, that's, that's easier, isn't it? I don't think I have to get anything behind there. It's just another giant maze. I had no idea maintenance would be so hard. Where am I going? Oh. Oh, hey, it's G-Man. <laughs> he's, he's spazzing out, too. Man, everything is so buggy right now. Okay, G-Man. I will see you later, I suppose. Oh. I have to push the button. I guess that will kind of help me get across. Because if I didn't push the button, it wouldn't let me get across. Even though I already pushed it. I could have sworn I pushed it. Meh. Let's just go. I don't want to be on this bridge for very long. Something bad could happen. Something absolutely terrible. Please tell me there's something hidden here. No. There's no hidden images in here this time. 
I'm still a little traumatized by that image in the bathroom. <laughs> Sector G man I thought that said G man right there. Good lord. Is there anything here? Nothing but the suicide. Team tram routes. Red line. Level three dormitories, sector G, hydroelectric area three, security, freight yard, blue line. Sector C, test labs, sector B, coolant reserve, area nine. Transit hub. I think we were at sector C in Half-Life 1. Just the original Half-Life, I should say. Green line, level one, main facility entrance, sector E, biodome complex. Area seven, recreational facilities. Sector A, training facility. We were there. Yellow Line, Sector D, Administration, High Altitude Launch Center, Sector F, Lambda Complex. Bought to you by Black Mesa Transit Authority. Push! Well, let me push. Quick save. What's going on here? Well, it's about time. We don't pay you people to mosey around at your own convenience. I like Make your shoes. This thing work so we can get on with this miserable day. What are you looking at? Okay, what? What are you looking at? Well, I wish he would stop staring at me. That's getting kind of creepy. Do you have something to say to me, Albert? Like, you were, seriously, the worst in the first game. Okay, can I just say, you were freaking me out. <laughs> he said anomalous materials. So what was the point of stopping here then? So just to hear that conversation. I'm trying not to interrupt these scientists right now. What? Aliens. Oh. It begins. So this is why Albert was here. The oh my god, he died. What? Oh! Night. No! Don't kill him! He's my friend! Get out of there! Oh dear. So is it just... Lon! Shoot him down! Shoot them down! Oh, oh my god! <laughs> this is the best opening sequence ever. Dude, is that guy over there gonna be okay? Where are we going? Albert, I'm scared. Hug me. Eh! 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 What? Oh my god, oh my god. Wake up, Barney. Come on. Where, where, where's the enemy? Um, where's, where'd the enemy go? I'm kind of scared now. Also, I should mention that this playthrough will be done in hard mode. Hey, wait, wait a second. Where, where's Albert? What? Dude, you, your body disappeared. Where the hell is Albert? I really shouldn't question it. I just want to break up these boxes. I really like how you get different view models for Barney in this game. It's kind of cool. It's better than just seeing the HEV, the hazard suit, view model all the time. Is there nothing in these boxes? Well, I guess I'm spoiled enough. I mean, I already have a pistol and a crowbar. Oh god! <laughs> that's a, that's a, that's indeed an enemy right there. Well, these are pretty much really easy to kill as is, so I'm not. I shouldn't be too concerned. Boxes! Please tell me there's something in these boxes. Anything that could be of potential use for my person. I'm scared that something is gonna pop out of these. Like, really soon. 
And since I have the sound turned down so low, I have no idea if I'm going to be hearing half of the stuff in this game. Which really isn't good. There, I can break that box. What is in the hallway? Nothing. Well, that pleased me, I have to say. There's something around this corner. Oh, there are boxes. I can I have to destroy all the boxes. It is my mission to make sure the entire box army is defeated and I've saved Black Mesa. I am Barney Calhoun, Super Soldier! Don't you, don't you guys remember that Super Soldier? Man, that was that was a funny occurrence. Disconnect power. Well, I'm trying to. You're not really laying me. Is there like a ventilation shaft I can crawl into here or something? Anything at all? There's a clip. Well, I'm getting stuck already. <laughs> okay, no. No, it looks like we just have to go down the stairs. There's nothing up here except a couple of rare clips. Open. Open, I say. Come on. I don't have anywhere else to go. What do you want me to do? I can't be blown up. Do I not have security clearance? Like, there's a health station here, but what good does that me do? That do me. That me do. To be or not to be. Come on. Maybe the barrel's actually blocking it. Does it open towards me? Does it... Do I have to enter a certain combination lock? Do I have to shoot the thing? I, I'm fine with shooting the thing. Do I have to bust it? Okay, let's bust it. Let's bust this damn thing open. I'm lost. <laughs> we have just started the action, and I am completely bloody lost. Can't use the elevator anymore. Um... Check the storage again. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. I get it. I see how it is. I didn't use my head properly. You know, I always thought that my head would be much better as a bowling ball, but I guess not. Well, through logical reason, we can open that door now and we can progress further. Um. Eh, head crabs. Well. I'm not gonna, yo, screw it, I'm not gonna waste my pistol ammunition on you. Come at me. Yeah, you're just as obnoxious as you were in the original game. But that guy took a lot less hit points. Did I already shoot him or something? I don't want to touch that water. Ooh. You're, you're an enemy. Man, it feels like... I accidentally pressed the F5 button, which stopped the recording, but anyways, we are in this room now, and... I don't think we can... Actually, we can get out, but we killed a couple more enemies. That water is hazardous, and those barrels cannot be blown up. Um, I, I apologize for that. I shall try to be more careful with my fingers from now on. Oh, hi. Calhoun, how did you get through the power lock? Well, it doesn't matter. The only other way out of here is through the canal. If you do make it to the surface, don't tell anyone I'm down here. I think they're trying to kill us all. Now get out of here. The canal is where you want to be. Helpful information. Okay then. Oh, you're up here. All right, I, I see where this is. All right, I, th I thought this was like a completely new area. So I have to go down the canal. Where is the entrance to the said canal? Because I'm really curious to know. Um. I guess this was just like an extra area and I have to jump down there. Please leave me alone. I don't want them to hear us. If you want to escape, go through the canal. Okay, okay, I'm going. It's just, it took me a moment to realize where I was supposed to go. No need to. So, and see with me. <laughs> Ow. Ah, Valve, you really need to fix that. Fall damage. Wait a minute. Is this where I came from? Where am I going? Um... Can I... Yeah. Jump on this computer and do something about that. I can't open that door back there. With the barrels. Maybe it is telling me I have to go back. 
I better check just to be safe. Open the door. I want out of this place. I have to find the canal. Where is the canal? Um, I don't think I'm supposed to be back here. Can I, like, I don't think I can turn the power back on. I just busted the damn thing. Disconnect power for attempting to access maintenance. <sighs> First playthroughs, everybody. You get lost so easily. Where is the entrance to the canal? I'm really curious to know. Is it gonna let me back in the door? Yeah. Funny, because it kept closing on me the last time. There has to be somewhere I have to go from up here. Just, just dropping by. No business with you, don't worry. Uh, <laughs> oh. Where am I going? What is my mission? Okay, got it. Brains. I have them. You have to admit, I have a brain, okay? We have confirmed this and we can move on. Good lord. Well, it should have been obvious. I mean, that's why the explosive barrels were there to begin with. I'm so scared that I'm just going to get suddenly face raped by a head crab right now. It's not going to be pleasant. Oh, uh, okay. I think I see where I'm supposed to go. Is there anything back here? No. Okay. This is the only way we can go. I feel like I'm about to fall off the ledge any second now. Take me somewhere magical. Maybe I'll get like a cutscene or something here. Uh, no, I get enemies. This is this is what I deserve, isn't it? Well, thankfully, hound eyes really aren't that much of a threat per se. That's what I like about them. They're cute, and they are non-lethal. To a degree, that is. South tunnel axis, north tunnel axis. I take it that this one just doesn't work at all. Looks like I'll be going to the south tunnel then. Yes. Door still won't open. Alright, to the south tunnel we go. I'm kind of scared to go in there, but I shall venture. In. Oh god, of course. Not just when I break the crowbar out. The armor seems to be doing its job. I'm I'm pleased by that. Man, I really wish I had a high in place for that kind of situation. Forty guns are not exactly pleasant. Alright, I don't think these boxes can be destroyed. Uh you can be destroyed though. You can be destroyed by my pistol. Oh don't don't give me a hug. But I just took a shower, okay? I don't need fleas on me, I hope you realize. I still yeah, I can still bludgeon enemies. I want this game. It just gets a point back because I can bludgeon enemies. That makes perfect sense. You are somebody who can get under here, but I don't want you getting under here. Stop eating my friend. I said, stop eating my friend, okay? Is it really that difficult? Anything else in these boxes? It has to be. Maybe there's a claymore behind one of these. Maybe there's a head crab. There's, there's an enemy behind here. I sh I can't expect that. I have to say, I do actually feel a bit bad because they do make dog-like voices, and I kind of like dogs. I mean, I'm more of a cat person, even though I'm allergic to them, but I like dogs. Dogs are adorable. Okay, so basically, here's how the armor system works. Instead of HEV suit energy, you pick up helmets and breastplates from fallen security guards. It's a bit morbid, but <laughs> hey, hey, whatever works for Barney. He just, he's, feeds off of dead bodies, pretty much. This is a really slow lever. What does this accomplish? Oh, isn't that nice? Can I ride that or something? See how it works. That's cool. All right. So I have to make my way up there somehow. 
I don't think. Okay, I I get why. Does this go down any lower? Apparently not, but I want to move this box up so that way I can actually get up there. Can I... Please? Maybe I have to use the box to jump up here. I'm going to assume that I have to. Ah, <laughs> oh, give, me, give me a second. I can get this. Yes! I can get this! <laughs> I cannot get this. And the box is moving again. Stay there. I appreciate it if you stayed there. All right. What's my jumping height? It looks like I I can just barely reach the platform there. Just barely. Maybe if I do a duck jump. Oh, yep, that works. Can I duck jump up here? No. <laughs> We're gonna be here for a while. Please. Just can I move this box? No. Too heavy for me. Maybe I'm not the super soldier I once believed I was. I was. I was. Yeah. I'm running off commentary, I'm sorry, okay? I do plan on ending the episode real soon. It just, I need to get up this platform. It matters to me. Can I please just duck jump? Get enough height up here. Oh wow, that was unnecessarily precise. Ah yes, I can reach the ladder. There are so many things to celebrate about right now. I don't really like that rumbling noise. I don't want to know what that was. Drainage canal access. Well, you know what? That looks pretty scary, and I don't really want to go there in this episode. So, I think I'm going to cut the footage right here. And, man, I'm really liking this game already. But this is just awesome. I can't wait to play the other expansion packs after this. Well, anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. I guess I will see you in the next episode. 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 Have a great day or evening. Goodbye.